Hi my beauties, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well. As you would have already seen on the community post and on very popular request, I have a haul video for you guys. So I shopped a ton of skincare, hair care and makeup from both Nykaa and Purple. I have most of the stuff here, but a lot of it I've called for, I have ordered, but it's on its way, but I couldn't contain my excitement and I wanted to show all of this to you guys. Also, this is going to give you a glimpse of what you can expect in the coming months in terms of reviews. Now, if you're new here, hi, I'm Chitali. Please do join my subscriber family. Do take a moment to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon. And now without further ado, let's dive right into this video. So guys, I have two boxes full of this much stuff. So I'm going to be running through all the products very quickly. Otherwise, we're going to be sitting here forever. Do grab a cup of tea or coffee or a snack because this is definitely going to be a long video. The first thing that grabs my attention right on top of the first carton is uh, the Pons Light Moisturizer. You guys know that I love the Pons Super Light Gel and so I wanted to give this one a go also. I have bought this in the full size, the biggest size. Next, I'm going to go in and uh, show you some other products that I have here. I have the Blossom Kocha Aroma Magic Lavender Face Wash. Again, a lot of you had asked for Blossom Kocha products, uh, uh, the Aroma Magic line in specific. So you're going to see a lot of it here. Now, there's no segregation between purple and uh, Nika boxes because everything is mixed right here. So I'm just quickly brushing through everything that I have here. Then I have the Just Herbs Rose Water, another brand that has been highly highly requested for a review then what i see here and i did buy a lot of good vibes products so let me know in the comment section because i wanted to do another good vibes only sort of a video because the last one that i did you guys really liked it so i bought some other popular products from their range first i have a green tea toner uh, which is again very popular so i picked up their uh, top uh, selling products again like the last time so let me know in the comment section below if you want to see another video like that and then I have their Rosehip Deep Cleansing Face Wash. Now, I really wanted to give this product a go because this looked very different. I haven't used a face wash that has rosehip in it. Um, then I also picked up the brand, which is Alps Goodness. And what I have here is their toner, and this is their Haldi toner. Now, you guys know that I use a lot of Haldi in my DIY, so I wanted to give this one a go and see how this actually is. Uh, then again, the stuff that I'm coming into my hand is coincidentally... All of it is Good Vibes. This is the Good Vibes Rose Hip um, Face Scrub. Uh, if you guys have seen my previous Good Vibes video, you would know that I really liked the pomegranate scrub. So this one right here. Then another brand that I see is the Vyam Ayurveda. This is their vitamin C pack. Again, a brand that you guys wanted me to review. So I bought this one as well. Two products from M Caffeine. Um, I have the Green Tea Face Wash, the Detox one. I'm already trying out for almost about two months now their uh, green tea serum. And then I have the M Caffeine Naked Detox Green Tea Moisturizer. So I'm going to be reviewing all of these products. But of course, I will take my time because I use everything for at least three to four weeks before reviewing anything. And um, then something. So just to let you know, guys, and a little bit of a confession, I've already been using a lot of products that you see here because I have uh, the stuff started trickling in almost about 10 days ago. So this is something that I've already been using. I've used this about twice, this uh, thrice in fact. This is the Kama Ayurveda Bringadi Intensive Hair Treatment. I finished off my Pure by Priyanka hair oil, the onion oil. So I was looking for something else and this is something which I have heard great reviews about. I've only used it about twice, thrice, but I am going to give my review once I've uh, used this one enough. Uh, then... I'm running out of breath because clearly I'm speaking very quickly. What I have here is the Pack Pro 01 eyelashes. I am wearing the Pack eyelashes. So, uh, you know, they are something that's super affordable as well. Something that you can, you know, uh, they're about 200, 250 rupees at the max. So I really like the quality. They last you fairly well as well. By the way, if you want to see this look that I'm wearing on my eyes, uh, the very beautiful smoky eye look in blue, then uh, do follow me on my Instagram. I'm going to be posting this look uh, on my Instagram. Then what I see here and something that I've used before and restocked is the Bio Honey Water Pore Tightening. And this is um, from Biotique. This is the one that I spoke about in my toners video as well, the top 10 toners video. Again, use this, loved this, very good for dry skin and works really well on my skin as well. Uh, then I have here four uh, lipsticks. Now, this is a very different brand that I have been trying out. Uh, because they are cruelty free, they are paraben silicon free. All of their products, uh, I personally am really liking. So I have four lipsticks. I already had two. 
Uh, what I have here is from House of Makeup. They have a lot of eyeliners and lipsticks also. So I have four of their lipsticks here uh, in all different colors. Uh, let me quickly tell you the colors. It's brown with it. Then I have uh, Sorry Not Sorry. Then I have Girl Boss. And then I also have Loki. Again, like I said, I have two of the other colors which I really like. So I decided to pick these ones as well. The other two products from House of Makeup are two of their Kohl's. And then what I have here, again, something that I've used is the Kama Ayurveda Organic Henna Powder. Now, this is something that I've used once, but I will be uh, reviewing this product also, but only once I'm satisfied and I've used it enough. Uh, then quickly going in, a couple of things that I bought. Uh, let me pick up a makeup product. I have the Lash Fixer from Pack. So I don't wear false eyelashes a lot, but whenever I do my, uh, the first one that I had almost uh, finished off, so I picked up another one. Then I have one of my favorite things, which is a rose water. And I have this one from Forest Essentials. I have been uh, wanting to try this one out. You guys know that I love Kama Ayurveda, but this is something I really wanted to give go and see how this actually is. Uh, then something, again, I have used this a couple of times, is the Plum Green Tea Revitalizing Face Mist. Now, I have uh, been loving mists. In fact, uh, in the past year, I did collect and use a lot of mists, something that has grown on me because I really feel that face mist during the day really hydrate my skin. So um, this is something I wanted to pick up and a lot of you had asked for a review. So this one right here. Then uh, another product from Alps Goodness is their Sandalwood Face Wash. Uh, something I haven't opened, not used. So uh, yeah, you will be seeing a lot of uh, brands that are available on purple. And these products were very affordable, guys, the purple ones uh, in specific. Then again, from Blossom Culture, I have the Aroma Magic Skin Toner. This is uh, for oily skin. Uh, I have combination skin, so oily skin stuff also works on my skin. And in fact, even dry skin things also, some of them work on my skin so i uh, wanted to give this one a go then i see a product which a lot of you had asked for a review of um, i have a product from wow here this is the apple cider vinegar shampoo uh, so i have run out of uh, one bottle of wilba and almost running out of one bottle of pure by priyanka shampoo so i wanted to give this one a go uh, this on the packaging says it's sulfate paraben and silicon free so we'll be using this one and also reviewing it for you guys Moving on, I picked up a couple of stuff from Bath & Body Works because it launched on Nykaa. I have used their products in the past, especially their hand creams, and I totally love it. I've also used their body uh, washes, which I've loved quite a lot. The first thing that I'm going to show you, which is one of my favorites, I have used this quite a lot already. This is the A Thousand Wishes Moisturizer. I have this for a while now. I love this completely. It's really, I mean, it smells like heaven in my opinion. I really love the fragrance. Then the other two shower gels, haven't used, haven't opened. Um, I have one in a million and a thousand wishes. Again, these are in travel size. I like to pick up things. Oops. I like to pick up things in travel size. But uh, this one, both of these, uh, you know, sounded and looked different. And I'd used the thousand wishes uh, cream, the body cream. So I wanted to give this one a go. Then what I have here, and I love these, uh, like I just generally love hand cream. So I have two here. One is at the beach and one is hello beautiful from again bath and body works now both of these i haven't used i've used other ones from bath and body works and i've always loved their products uh, shower gels is something that i'm really wanting to try and i really hope it works on me on my very sensitive body um it's because my skin on my body tends to get rashes very easily so i'm very skeptical of using uh, shower gels in particular the next thing i restocked is the nivea deodorant fresh natural Again, something uh, that I have run out many bottles of. I always have a backup of this. I have a full bottle, but I ordered another one because uh, Nika was on sale. This was on a little bit of a discount, to be honest. And um, then what I have here is the Nika Skin Shield Anti-Pollution Foundation. Now, I have used this before as well, but I got the wrong color. It was too deep for me. Uh, this one, I do not know whether it's going to be the right color for me. What I've ordered is 06 Warm Nude and I did open the packaging to see and uh, it did look a little bit too warm for me. So that's the problem because I'm neutral undertone. Um, you know, I tend to get foundations, tend to order foundations that have very yellow undertones. Nonetheless, this is a very good foundation. I have used it in the past. I mixed with other foundations, but I really am hoping this is a good color match for me because overall the foundation is excellent in my opinion. Um, then what I have, something that I restocked is uh, the Tulips cotton wipes, the cotton pads for your face. Because I wear a lot of uh, waterproof mascara. 
this is uh, i mean it really works for me because uh, the only thing that removes that is the clinic uh, you know the the balm that you get the clinic makeup removing balm that i use on my lashes i massage them a little bit and then i take a wipe and just wipe off my eyelashes with it so uh, these come really handy and also they are lint free so you know they uh, also really are very soft on the skin moving on to the second carton and uh, clearly you guys have seen that i went way overboard but honestly i wanted to you know try out different brands that you guys have been requesting because uh, clearly there's no turning down your request for sure and uh, these are the brands that all of you have asked and the ones that you don't see here don't worry because i've ordered those and like i said they are on the way uh, the rest of the good vibes products i'm going to show you first is the vitamin e nourishing face cream now you would know why i bought this clearly because this has vitamin e in it i have used this once or twice i'm not going to review it right here i want to use this enough to tell you my opinion on this one then i have something very interesting it's the brazilian volcanic green clay mask now i have used uh, clay masks in the past but this is the brazilian clay mask clearly something i haven't used and i wanted to give this one a go and see then i bought a face mist which is the lavender and mint refreshing face mist clearly i am into a lot of face mist these days in fact since the past uh, couple of months almost past 6 months i think since the summer started in april i have been uh misting my face uh since uh, april itself because it's so hot in delhi and you know during the day you definitely need something to refresh your skin and rehydrate your skin uh then i have a complimentary aloe vera gel uh, when you order from good vibes they are very kind to send all of these complimentary things uh then uh, uh i have the black grapes a lip balm now i have a ton of lip balms but i never ever fail to order more so i have right here and then two products from pons which uh, i think a lot of you had asked me to review one of these at least which is the pons uh, vitamin micellar water they have three variants but i think this is the most popular one so i wanted to give this one a go and see how this works then i wanted a small body lotion to put in my bag because sometimes when i'm on the go uh, you know it just feels dry so i have here the pons a triple vitamin silky smooth moisturizing lotion um clearly the bottle looked uh, it's super affordable guys by the way i think this is about 100 rupees for uh, this much bottle and then this is something that i can easily uh, go around with then another product i see in this carton which a lot of you had asked to uh, be reviewed on my channel this is the good vibes rose hip radiant glow face serum now this is a super affordable product i must say clearly i haven't used it so i don't know uh, the performance of the products uh, but a lot of you asked for this one so i bought this as well then i have a derma doc product again something a lot of you asked to review this is the skin plumping face serum this is the vitamin c and hyaluronic acid serum anyway vitamin c serums attract me a lot because uh, i mean i'm always on the hunt for a good vitamin c serum so i wanted to give this one a go then a different thing actually what i have here is the henna hyena beauty eye lashes um so the packaging is really cute if you will see and then you know this is a magnetic sort of fake eye lashes so i don't use a lot of eye lashes like i said like the fake eye lashes but this looked really attractive so i bought this one then i have something which is actually a rocky gift from my sister it is the makeup revolution tommy x uh, eyeshadow palette this is their colored eyeshadow palette Thank you so much love I love you so much thank you for this one uh, I anyway wanted to buy this so yeah she knows what I need and uh, then I have uh, the uh, coal from the brand sugar this is the heavy duty coal in the color green I'm not really sure why I picked up the color green uh, I think I want to make an eye look like I've made this one which is the blue one so this one this actually comes with a sharpener which i can see here but i really like when eye pencils come with a sharpener that's very thoughtful of uh, the brand then what i have here is the alps goodness rose face mask i think this is a sampler like this must have come free or i may have ordered i don't really know but this one in particular looked uh, very interesting by the way then i have last two products for you guys which is the su stay quirky badass kajal and i have the pearly one and i have the blue one i've already used the black one it is super super beautiful because it glides on like butter and it stays put as well so i wanted to try uh, these two as well guys forgot to mention the last product that i have here is uh, something that i've been uh, wanting to try for a long time this is the farsali daydream set now this actually comes with very small sample bottles of the farsali unicorn essence uh, skin tune blur and volcanic elixir 
all of these three uh, products from Farsali are so very popular and apparently everyone on Instagram is obsessed with it. So I wanted to get my hands on it and see what the hype is all about. So yeah, in case you want me to review this one as well, let me know in the comments section. So guys, now we've come to an end of this video. I really hope that you liked this video and enjoyed watching it as much as I enjoyed filming it. I hope you got a glimpse of the videos, reviews that you can expect in the coming months. Now, if you like this video, please do give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and also hit the notification bell. And until I see you next, guys, thank you so much for watching. Love you all. Bye-bye.